cold comfort. There is a comfort in shortening days, in dark at five and dark road shining. Rain on the windows whispers permission to bolt the door and let the curtains sigh along the rail. Outside the pressure's low and the moon's demands are muffled in cloud. A rose bush, straggled with age, taps at the glass and an ill-fitted door knocks a little, now and again. It's not quite cold enough to light the fire, but I'll do it anyway. Lay the kindling across paper, rattle coal from the scuffle, wait for the crackle and draw. Nothing is happening. No one is calling. And I'm glad of the night, the rain. The apple name I chose to write about is Garter. Garter. Midsummer's Eve. You peel an apple, its skin a snake, a stocking ribbon, and curl it under your pillow. In your dreams you see me offering my life and the small stranglehold of marriage. In the morning, a soft red bruise. I had to hightail it slightly to get here this evening. Um, but this is nothing to the man who raced fire. He'd never seen such a horse before. The size of its flanks, black but an unending tail of orange and reds. The galloping stallion was racing his truck, jumped bushes, fences, trees, homes. His speedometer soared and then he couldn't keep up with the pound of hooves kicking up smoke, gas tanks exploding. The stones cracked his windscreen sky. 